Casino Royale is my favorite movie of all time and by far my favorite Bond movie of all time. It stars Daniel Craig as 007 or James Bond and uh, really brings to life a connection between characters and cinema like no other movie I've ever seen. Um, some even call it the perfect Bond film, that there could be nothing ever better than it and that it hit all of the high points that James Bond could ever hope to. And I really think that's brought to light by Vesper Lind, who is Bond's main love interest throughout the story. And Vesper Lind is played by Ava Green, who is by far my favorite actress in the film and just favorite role in the film in general. And it's easily the strongest female character role I've ever seen in a film ever. You know, she's just absolutely incredible. And she does everything right to compliment James Bond's character, including bringing him into his humanity and then back out of it at the end of the film. Uh, also supporting both Bond and Vesper, Le Chief, who is played by Mads Mikkelsen, another one of my top ten favorite actors, um, really creating a trifecta in, you know, a trifecta of the pinnacle of simple cinema, plays an amazing villain and uh, is able to really bring Bond down into his most rock-bottom, gruesome moments uh, throughout the film and also is capable of creating some of the most drama-filled scenes throughout the entire film as well. Uh, Le Chief is actually part of a deeper conspiracy within Casino Royale involving a man named Mr. White who... Uh, ends up using both Le Chief and Vesper to get closer to MI6 and using uh, Daniel Craig as 007 to get there as well. Uh, and in the end is ultimately the reason why Vesper ends up dying, uh, as well as her connection to her previous love interest in using Daniel Craig. Um, this movie was very widely received by everybody and very loved, as you can see, just nothing but four and five star reviews and has an eight out of ten and a general 90% approval rate by just about everybody who's ever seen it, and I couldn't agree more. I think it's one of the best titles of all time. The way that Bond moves through the through the film and the settings of the film, um, he starts in an exhilarating on-foot chase up buildings, you know, just a bunch of crazy different stuff that really draws your attention at the beginning of the movie and slowly builds his character into a more and more ruthless and raw and 007 MI6 emotionless character just to be thwarted by Vesper Bond in the end who once again brings out his emotional side and uh, really gives his character a lot of humanity but then dies later tragically as it's unraveled that she's using Bond to make money to free her previous lover. Bond's even tortured, and then Vesper is unfortunately killed in, in the crossfire of everything uh, by drowning underwater. And that really tears Bond's humanity away. She, Vesper was the only girl that Bond ever loved, truly loved. And uh, I think that really sets the pace of the movie being just absolutely fantastic. So I definitely recommend that anyone who sees this review give the movie a try if they haven't, because it's it's just one of the best watches I've ever had of you know in in my cinema history. So I can't appreciate it enough for uh, watching my review. Thank you.